What up, what up, Winboy Share. And the number one question I've been getting ever since Unreal Engine 5.3 added VDB support is, how exactly do you render it out inside the sequencer? So I'm gonna take you step by step of all the important steps that you need to take because there are some caveats in there that are mixing some people up, but I feel like I found the simplest solution to get to where you need to go. So if you wanna see this, make sure you go to my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Jonathan Wimbush, and I catch you on the flip side. I'll see you soon, take care.